Most flaring tools require a third arm. Lucky for you, this one doesn't. Get to know the Hillmore Quick Engage Flare and Swage, and you'll be executing picture-perfect flares and swages in no time. First, prep the tube for flaring by cutting to length and deburring the inside and outside of the tube end. Place the flare nut in position on the tube. Attach the flare cone to the yoke. Using the spring-loaded block that works like a clothespin, insert the tube into the correctly sized hole and slide the tube against the height gauge to ensure the correct flare height. Next, close the block to secure the tubing. Good news, you don't need to tighten any wing nuts. If the block doesn't close, try squeezing it shut without pinching your hand. Sometimes, if the tube is out of round, the block may be difficult to close. If this happens, slide the yoke as far as you can on the block and tighten the sidebar to close the block. Once the block is closed, loosen the sidebar and continue sliding the yoke down the block until it aligns over the tube. The ball detents along the side help align the yoke to the correct position. The height gauge is moved out of the way by the yoke when it slides over the tube. Tighten the sidebar to lock the yoke into place. Push down on the ergonomic yoke handle to engage the tube quickly. Turn the handle, making complete rotations until the flare is formed and the handle cannot be turned anymore. To release the tube once complete, turn the handle counterclockwise, push down the green release button on the back of the tool, and remove or slide the yoke down and away from the tube to open the block. To swage, it's as simple as following the same basic instructions for flaring. However, in place of the flare cone, select the correct size expander head for the tubing you're working with. Also, when you place the tube in the block, keep the tube end about one and a half times the diameter of the tube above the top of the block so that there is enough material to make a swage. For example, a quarter inch tube should be three eighths inch above the top of the block. Get in, get out, and get on to the next job. It's time to retool and conquer with Hillmore's Quick Engage Flare and Swage. Contact Hillmore Technical Services for additional product information at 1-800-642-0010.